Meteorologist Brett Anderson here in the Tel Aviv Weather Center. Here's the forecast for the rest of your Tuesday and beyond. Again, a cold front has moved across the state, and that means we'll see cold temperatures, falling temperatures, and then there is a chance for scattered snow showers as we head through later this morning, this afternoon. Probably looking at those snow showers starting to move into the Lincoln area around 6 o'clock or so. Scattered snow showers this evening, windy conditions, and again, falling temperatures much colder this afternoon, this evening compared to what we had in the last 24 hours. We will see blustery conditions into Wednesday morning with a few passing clouds otherwise mostly sunny skies not as windy on Wednesday and we will see temperatures at least back into the 40s across the state with some 50s returning into western sections of the state by Wednesday afternoon. Wind advisory until midnight for eastern section of the state eventually we could see gusts between 45 and 50 miles per hour in eastern areas again especially as we head into uh, your Tuesday afternoon and Tuesday evening. Now we do expect some scattered snow showers. Most of us expecting a bit of a dusting, a trace, maybe a few locations up to a half an inch, maybe some isolated areas, especially for northern and western Nebraska, might see a couple of spots around an inch or snow or so. But again, we're not looking for much in the way of snowfall in central and eastern section of the state. But again, for the Lincoln area, the wind will begin to increase as we head towards especially this afternoon with those gusts between 45 and 50 miles per hour this afternoon and this evening. As far as precipitation chances, as I mentioned, we may start to see some flurries by 5, but I think as we head towards 6 o'clock through at least 9 o'clock, we're talking about a 30% chance for these snow showers and then just flurries or a brief snow shower through at least midnight. Then the precipitation should come to an end and we'll see decreasing clouds. Here's a look at the forecast uh, models, the, uh, the, for the models that we look at as far as the snowfall potential in the Lincoln area the next 24 hours. And all of these forecast models in Pretty good agreement, basically suggesting a half an inch or less as far as what we see this evening as those snow showers move through. So Lincoln today, we're looking for a high of 53, but that'll occur late in the morning, then a 30% chance for snow showers this evening. Eventually, mostly cloudy skies will develop, and the north wind will increase 25 to 35 with gusts to 45 to 50 miles per hour. So again, here's the temperature planner for the Lincoln area. Our temperature, high temperature, will probably occur this morning and then fall down to the mid-30s by 5 o'clock. Again, the wind is going to make it feel colder. By 11 o'clock, we could be around 20, and it's still going to be windy. We will have those scattered snow showers for this evening. So a, a morning high of 53 in Lincoln, 48 in Seward. A lot of these other high temperatures that you see will primarily, primarily be in the morning or they've already occurred and then falling temperatures throughout the afternoon. 53 in Lincoln, 44 in Aurora and again it could be in the teens for much of the afternoon hours for northern and northwestern section of the state. Here are the lows tonight dropping down into the single digits in the teens. 12 in Lincoln also in Grand Island with 10 in O'Neill. Here's a look at the forecast wind chill at 7 o'clock Wednesday morning. It could be around zero in Lincoln, one below in Nebraska City, three above in Grand Island, two above in O'Neill. So Wednesday morning will be cold and the wind will make it feel even colder. Now we do expect sunny skies with a bit of a rebound in the afternoon. Could be in the upper 40s and near 50 for central Nebraska, 54 in McCook. Lincoln, the forecast high is 43. Our average high is 45. So really looking at a temperature tomorrow afternoon close to the seasonal average. But we do warm up on Thursday with highs back up into the 60s, but it will be windy with a south-southwest wind increase in 10 to 20 with gusts eventually between 35 and 40 miles per hour by Thursday afternoon. Here's the 10-day forecast for the Lincoln area. Again, cold again tonight, cold Wednesday morning, but temperatures will recover. In fact, by Friday, March 1st, first day of meteorological spring, looking at upper 60s and still breezy. Breezy and warm on Saturday with mid-70s, upper 70s on Sunday, but it will be windy and a slight chance for showers late in the day. Slight chance for showers on Monday, windy, and it will be cooler with mid-50s. It looks like temperatures should stay above average next week for Tuesday and Wednesday with mid to upper 50s, lower 60s on Thursday with a slight chance.